Hello everybody, and this is Argon Matrix welcoming you to my pause menu. Yes, this is the 37th episode of my pause menu in the Legend of Zelda Ocarina of Time. And here's the running man. So let's put on our bunny hood and talk to him. And he's like, I bet with those long ears you can hear voices. Oh, I thought, hear the voices. I thought he's just like, hear voices. Like, what? I can hear voices fine without these bunny ears, you stupid. Okay. Oh, those are, these are genuine rabbit ears from the animal of legend. What, the Easter bunny? Oh my god, I want to meet him. Dude, do you know him? I don't care how expensive it is. Please sell it to me. It's part of the Easter bunny. Do, uh, uh, fine. My long time dream, returning to the wildlife. Finally, the actor, stage, and prop have been united. What? the hell? It's a 50 rupee mask, but he paid you a crazy amount of money for it. More money than you can count. Go back to the mask shop and pay just 50 rupees of this money. Stupid Skulltula style child thing. Did I just call it a Skulltula? Anyway, so yeah, he basically fills up. No matter how many rupees you have at the moment of talking to him, he will fill up your wallet. And that's why I wanted to get the wall upgrade before I went and did that. So, there you go. That's how you do that. And that will com actually complete the mask side quest. Except for one little itsy bitsy thing that we have to do. And that is just going to be at the forest stage. Yeah, I know. It's been a long time. I don't even know if you remember it. Yeah, so I don't know what that stupid running man guy was about, but he's he, he's just like, return to the wildlife, what? What are you, like a horse or something? Are you gonna go and eat hay in the forest? That didn't make sense, but whatever. Anyways, let's go into the castle town now. Go back to the mask shop and pay back just 50 rupees of this money that he gave us. I don't know where that guy got so much money. He's freaking loaded. He must have given like 200 sculptula tokens to those people. And that weakened the curse like so much. And that now I just have to do the last hundred. Whatever. Anyways, let's talk to this guy. Oh great, you sold it. Please pay me back 50 rupees for the bunny hood now. Oh yeah. Very well done. All the masks are sold out. But I see two on the shelf right now. I knew I could trust you. As a reward, I will lend you this special mask. This is the mask of truth. It is a mysterious mask passed down by the Sheikah. With this mask, you can see into other people's minds. It's useful, but scary! Why is it scary? You may find out as you grow older and discover the true meaning of life. Ho, ho, ho. Santa Claus, thanks. This is the mask of truth. Oh my god, it's a Cyclops mask. That's scary, dude. From now on, you can borrow any mask you want. Just have faith. Have faith in what? Your mom? Oh, whatever. Anyway, so let's equip that mask of truth. Mask of truth. Uh, no. Not gonna save. Haven't saved since the start of this recording session. I don't want to screw up or anything and make a bad save, making me have to restart the entire game. That would suck. So, anyways, uh, yeah. Now we don't have a full wall. Poo. But we can. You know what? We can just fill it up outside on the drawbridge here. Anyways, yeah, I think I'll just fill up my rupees here, and then I'll meet you at the forest stage, because, I mean, you know how to get there, or you should, hopefully, because we've been there like a bazillion times, and we've had many different results. I have a feeling that we'll have a good one for this, or maybe not. I don't know. I've never actually done it before, as I've stated before. Dude, I want more money. Where's my money, punk? Where's my money, fool? I want money. What are you talking about, Willis? I have no idea what show that's from, but people at my school have been saying it day in and day out. Ah. Uh, I have a feeling that no one at my school knows. Dude. Dude, why am I not floating away? Is the current not strong enough? Dude, that's retarded. That's... Oh my god. No. Just, just no. Okay, guys, so I'm at the forest stage now. And yeah, here it is. Let's put on the mask and give her a go. Hmm, what do we think, my fellow comrades? What? He's like, dude, who is this guy? And why is he so awesome? 
All my young Deku Scrub brothers say, you have a horrible face. Oh my god, that's so mean. You just broke my heart. But don't worry, we will reward you with many Deku Nuts. Ooh. Of course, we will also enable you to carry more of them. Abracadabra. Alakazam! We got the thing. You can now carry even more Deku Nuts. You can carry up to 40 nuts. Oh my god, I can only carry two in my sack. Ha ha ha. Get it? I know dirty jokes for the loss. For the freaking loss, dude. Anyway, so now that we're done with that, uh, what else can we do? What else can I do? I don't know why I'm playing this right now. I was retarded, but whatever. Anyways, actually, I'm gonna go to Zora's River now, for some reason. You may comprehend it, you may not. You may just be like, what the hell is he doing? He's a retard. Anyways, let's hop into here. I'm gonna go ahead and dive down here, because I have the silver scale. Oh, yeah, buddy. Yeah, buddy. Yeah, buddy. And we're out in Zora's River. Oh, my God. That's awesome. Super warp. Tell him a fall. Man, I'm ripping off people left and right in these videos. I'm telling you. Dude, not cool. It could be rupees that I can't hold. Ah, you almost hit me. I was so scared. I was scared as I was with Ganondork, but whatever. Anyways. Uh, so, excuse me. We're just floating on down here. Oh my god. Go over this way. You hop across the river right here, because it's the only spot small enough for you to be able to hop across. Anyways, you want to talk to this guy. And he's like, chomp, chomp, chomp. How about some magic beans? They aren't selling very well. How about 10 rupees for one piece? Sure, good deal. And get some magic beans that look more like rainbow peas in a pod. If you want to plant beans, go around to look for soft for soil. Chomp, chomp, chomp. Incidentally, there's soft soil right here, but we'll plant it later. Because if you talk to him again, he's like, chomp, chomp, chomp. How about some magic beans? Well, they're not that popular yet. How about 20... Hey, you raised the price, dude. Not cool. Whatever. So now he's got some magic beans. Yeah, yeah. Mm. Basically, you can buy 10, 10 magic beans from this guy. And you're going to want them all. Probably. How about some magic beans? They're getting to be quite popular. Dude, you've only sold two. And now you and now the 30 rupees a piece? That's not cool. Actually, I don't even think that 500 rupees is enough to pay for all 10 of them. Chomp, chomp, chomp. How about some magic beans? They're all the rage. No, they're not. You sold three. You are tarred. And they're all to the same person, too. That person hasn't even left yet. Oh my god, chomp, chomp, chomp. We have the popular magic beans. You'll regret it if you don't buy them now. Buy them now for $49.95. Actually, dude. That was pretty pretty damn close. 50 rupees. Nice. $49.95. With GST, that rounds up to 50 bucks or more. Chomp, chomp, chomp. These are the super popular magic beans. In case you're wondering, they'll be sold out. They'll soon be sold out. Super price, 60 rupees. That's not super price. Your 10 rupees a piece was good. It was so much better. Look at me, I'm down to 290 rupees already. Dude, you're stripping me down to the balls. Chomp, chomp, chomp. We have the super rare magic beans. This could be your last chance. Well, he's right that they're super rare because he only he's the only one that seems to have them. Except for me. Because he keeps giving them to me. Or selling them to me. Anyways, chomp, chomp, chomp. We have the legendary magic beans. I'll sell them only to you. Super price, 80 rupees for one piece. Well, you're right when you're saying you're only selling them to me. I'll give you that much, but 80 rupees, seriously, dude. Chomp, chomp, chomp. Do you want magic beans? They, they aren't cheap, but do you still want them? Yeah, dude. I can't let them go for less than 90 rupees a piece. Sure. Do, 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 do. We have nine magic beans now. If you want to plant beans, go... go oh, I've already read that. Dude, no. And now he's like, chomp, chomp, chomp. We have magic beans. Do you want them? Huh? Huh? 
100 rupees for one piece. Yeah. Yeah. You don't have enough money. You don't have enough money, fool. What? Dude, not cool. Okay, so I think that's all that's going to be for this episode. I think we've done enough in this episode and this recording session. So, uh, there's a rupee. Working towards our total. We need we need 50, 49. 49 more rupees! Whatever. 48 more rupees! Oh my god! Racking them up like gangbusters! Anyways, that's all for this episode, like I said before. I hope you have enjoyed these past few episodes. I think I'm starting to get into the swing of this whole LPing thing. You know? Anyways, oh my god, camera, you suck. Anyways, this is Argon Matrix signing out. Thank you, and good night.